Hello friends, now we gather almost all the basic fundamental knowledge about technical analysis. And this knowledge is very helpful in our upcoming journey. If you are not aware of these things, then I request you to going through them. Because without this knowledge, you will not totally be able to understand everything. Now let's get started. And if you are hear this voice for the first time, don't forget to press the red subscribe button and turn on the bell notification to get interesting finance and share market videos. As I promise you, today we start learning about the charts and price patterns. To understand the charts completely, first we have to learn about its component. Means which things you have to keep your eye on when looking into a chart. Still confusing? I will give you an example. Price is one of them. Now I hope it's clear to you. Next, another important thing. Indian stock market is open from 9.15 am to 3.30 pm. And in this 6 hour 15 minute time, millions of transactions take place. Just imagine thousands of transactions in each minute. The question is that, do we need to keep track all of these individual transactions? Sound ridiculous, right? And it will be practically impossible to track every price points. Don't worry, you don't need to track these things to become a successful trader. Since it is difficult to track all the price points, every trader just track few important price points. These are open, high, low and close or OHLC in short. This can give us all the required informations. Let's understand this OHLC in details. The open, as its name suggests, is the price of a share when the market opens, that means at the time of 9.15 am. Then the high, I hope you already guessed it right is the highest price at which the share is trading on that particular time period. Next, the low. Is the lowest price at which the share is traded on that particular time period. And at last, the close. The close price is the most important price because it is the final price at which the market closed for a particular period of time. If you want to be an internet trader, then closing price is the most important thing for you. And if the close is higher than open, then it is considered as positive day, else negative. Of course, we will deal with this topic in greater details as we progress in this series. So don't forget to hit that red subscribe button and press that bell icon to get notified. If this video had any value to your life, hit that big fat like button and share this video to your family, friends and colleagues. Thank you so much for watching this video guys.